Democrat running in Virginia election has online sex videos exposed. Illegal invasion of my privacy. No, you, you posted them on Chatterbait. That's right. And everything on the internet is for Ed B. <laughs> uh, for Ed Suzanne Gibson, 40, said in a statement that leak in the videos was an illegal invasion of my privacy designed to humiliate me and my family. Uh, no. You should have thought of that before you were taking throat yogurt on camera. And accepting tips. Yes. And more and more, and more, more ways than one. You're taking tips in both hands and in all your holes. I don't know. What, what do you think, Pop? Would you give her a four? Uh, I don't know. How old is she now? 35, four. 35. 40 40 yep well when she was uh 22 24 she was probably a solid eight and i would give her a, a six now maybe five and a half that's pretty generous of you pop pretty generous but uh a democrat candidate running in the virginia general assembly has condemned reports that she performed on a pornographic website with her husband while t asking viewers for tips in return for carrying out specific sex act Susanna Gibbon, 40, a first-time candidate in a high-stakes race for a seat in the House of Delegates, issued a statement on Monday calling the exposure of the videos the worst gutter politics and an illegal invasion of my privacy designed to humiliate me and my family. Okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Politics has always been a dirty, backstabbing, throat-cutting, deceiving, betraying game. I have no idea what country you grew up in but if you had an idiot box in front of your face since you were a kid you would know these simple facts jesus christ yeah. i'm starting to get pissed off here <laughs> excellent yes use your anger <laughs> uh it won't intimidate me and it won't silence me the nurse practitioner wrote in the statement to the washington post my political opponents and the Republican allies have proven they're willing to commit a sex crime to attack me and my family because there's what, no line they won't cross. To what sex women. crime? Is but, she literally saying that because somebody pointed out the fact that she has porn on the internet, she's calling that a sex crime? That's what her comment is. What yep. a stupid bimbo. <laughs> Uh, it comes after the Post and the Associated Press reported the videos of the, the live streamed online sexual activity from one pornographic site was archived on another site. Oh, that's where the sex crime came in. Yeah, because they're, steal they're stealing uh, ad revenue and, uh, you know, chatterbait from, you know, getting their two cents from tips while she's getting tipped. It's not a crime. No. I'm sorry. Now, according to the screenshots reviewed by the Associated Press, Ms. Gibson had an account on Chatterbait, a legal website where viewers can watch live webcam performances that feature nudity and sexual activity. The Independent has reviewed the screenshots pur uh, purported to be from the videos posted on the, to the Chatterbait account, but was unable to independently confirm their authenticity. Of course they couldn't. Shocker. Get the hell out of here. Yeah. The videos reportedly shown Miss Gibson and her husband, John David Gibson, having sex and then pausing to ask viewers for donation called tips or tokens to watch private shows or see more specific sex acts carried out. So how much did you how much did you uh get paid for it to uh for your husband to put it in your butt? Listen, uh three dollars today's day and age. I know it's more accepting now for people to do stupid shit like this, but I, I'm sorry. You, <laughs> I hope she loses this election. It is oh, she's stupid. Oh, but uh, but but pop, if she loses, that's because people fucking exploited her sexuality. We need to give yeah, fuck off. Stop the whining. Yeah, I remember. I remember back when Democrats were bitching or complaining about Melania and claiming she was a prostitute. When she was just modeling. Well, hey, yeah. Democrats. Well, you know, a, I was a prostitute uh, and you're defending it. Yeah. Well, I mean, she was with her husband, right? So it's yeah. technically she's not a prostitute. She was having she was having sex on camera for tips. I'm yes. calling her a prostitute. All right. Or, 
Amateur. Okay, I won't go that far because she wasn't getting paid, you know, to fuck someone else. She was fucking her husband. We'll call her an amateur adult film star. Yes, that that's more accurate. That, there, that, there. Now that it, you know, just so I don't hurt anybody's fifis. They don't like the p we, word. We retract the prostitute yes, uh, we re comment. Yes, we retract that and replace it. Uh, and in at least two videos, she tells viewers that she's raising money for a good cause. <laughs> Dona uh, ca campaign donations because I'm pretty sure that's unethical. Uh, I don't know. I don't know the rules about that. That yeah, yeah. that's just insane. Just all the rules know. about raising yeah. money and what you can do with it. I don't know. Yeah. According to the post, more than a dozen videos posted under Miss um, Gibson's Chatterbait username were archived on a publicly available site or Recurbate on September 22 and September 2022, the month after she announced her candidacy. The most recent were two videos archived on 30 uh, September 30th, 2022, but it's unclear when the live stream occurred. The post reported. Miss Gibson's attorney, Daniel P. Watkins, told the uh, post that dis uh, dis disseminating the videos is a violation of Virginia's revenge porn laws which makes it a crime to maliciously dis, um, disseminate or sell nude or sexual activity images of another person on, with on the internet to coerce, harass, or intimidate. I'm sorry. You, if you're going to do that kind of shit and put it on the internet, you just need to you take your lumps. You're an idiot. Now you're paying the idiot tax. It's just that simple. And I believe for it to be revenge porn, uh, it has to be a former partner. That's that's yep. the revenge porn. That's day. the I was gonna say that's the uh, the re the revenge and yes. revenge porn. That's revenge porn. Yeah. Um, now, do I think that is fucked up? Yeah, I, I do. I mean, it is what it is. But people are dicks. Yep. But it people are dicks. But uh, you know, case in point, uh, the. Uh, subject of the topic people are also stupid yeah uh it's illegal and it's disgusting to disseminate this kind of material and we're working closely with the fbi and local prosecutors to bring the wrongdoers to justice mr Watkins said the independent has reached out to mrs gibson's <clears throat> campaign for comment so this marks an explosive term in the, a race that will carry significant weight in determining the balance of power in virginia general assembly Ms. Gibson, who won a Democratic primary in June, is running against Republican business, businessman David Owen. She, ha, uh, she has said it was the Supreme Court's 2022 uh, decision overturning Roe v. Wade that propelled her into the race. I'm sure this is a difficult time for Susanna and her family, and I'm remaining focused on my campaign, Mr. Owen said in a statement in a response to the news, according to the Associated Press. Well, um... <laughs> I wonder if that stuff is still out there on the archive channels. I wonder if they took it down yet. Yeah. Perhaps, maybe, but someone out there, someone out there in internet world has a uh, pretty much everything that she has done on camera downloaded. More than likely someone. it'll be scrubbed yeah. of uh, you know, the IP addresses and the MAC addresses and it'll be put up on right. the dark web and there it will live forever. Yep. And uh, it just ba it just baffles me that uh, Democrats are coming out saying, oh, well, you're, what you're doing is unethical. And, you know, yeah, yeah. Like, they always do that. They uh, always do that because guess what? Politics is a dirty fucking game. Yep. The reason the Republicans are not doing as well as the Democrats is because the Republicans have been trying to play clean. We have to stop doing that. We need to fight as dirty as the Democrats. It sucks. <laughs> But that's the way it rolls. There's no, there's no longer a place for taking the higher ground. Of course, nope. it's one hundred percent my opinion. Yep. <clears throat> uh, but uh, of course, she she goes back with the and says it's not about the sex; it's about the lie. What lies? What? There's a comment here saying it's still up, and she likes uh, pies, cream salty, not sweet. <laughs> That's ah, nasty, man. Ah, That's just ah, nasty, bro. Oh, man, that was a good one. That's nasty, bro. 
That was from Thumper, the sweaty fat guy. <laughs> That's well, Thumper's the one that uh, introduced uh, Billy Von Baum to a uh, chatterbait. So, oh. so if you if you guys uh, go over to Billy Von Baum's uh, shows and hang out for the after party, um, be afraid. Be very afraid. Be very afraid. afraid. <laughs> be very afraid. <laughs> uh, but uh, Politico asked uh, Tuesday, so what if a candidate live streams sex acts with her husband? And I might. I might agree, except that the media is describing Democrat Susan Gi uh, Susanna Gibbon as the victim of a leak, and she's playing along. Yeah, you can't really uh, claim a leak when you uh, click live, take your clothes off, and uh, take your yeah. husband's diaka. I mean, for, it would be money. one thing if this was taking place in like her bedroom and somebody got like a hold of a private video and then released that. That would probably be of revenge porn. But the fact that she was selling it or performing online for tips, that case is going to go nowhere, even if they find the person who did that. And it could be anyone because it's on an archive site and anyone with fingers can fucking find it. Like This is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, wrong oh, ridiculous. Lord. Yep. Uh, uh... Democrats and their media allies are trying to divert the debate into one which sex is the issue rather than the honesty. Republicans are being cast into the stereotypical role of scolds. New York Times, meanwhile, oh, oh, excuse me, said that Gibson is the candidate for a Virginia House of Delegates, has been the vit victim of a leak of sex tapes. Mm, yeah, we've it's already covered that. And they're it's, lying. It's, yeah. If you do it online and somebody else sees it, it's not a leak. Yep. Get the hell out of here. Uh, but Gibson performed publicly and raised money doing so. Yeah. She, publi she published the tapes herself on a live webcam website. Gibson has played along with the lie condemning what she calls illegal invasion of my privacy delegate designed to humiliate me and my family. Perhaps she has a, a copyright claim against whoever ever reproduced the videos on another site. Okay, that she could have some uh, standing on, but uh, it's still not a leak. Uh, but she did not have uh, what might be called reasonable expectations of privacy. No, she didn't. Because she put it out there herself. That's right. Uh, better to own the story rather than hiding from it. Arguably, she made her fans happy. There is a whole school of thought around the Orn Pay positivity. Besides, in today's hyper-partisan politics, many of her voters might not even care. Democrats will still vote for another Democrat, regardless of any other factor. Republicans are often the same. And that's why we're fucked. Yep. Her online career could even be a positive. In a political world where hetero heterosexual sex, never mind marital sex, is marginalized in favor of alternative genders and sexuality, Gibson might have something interesting to add to the conversation. But she's avoiding it, blaming others for political gain. Aww. Blaming others for blaming others, not accepting responsibility. Jeez, that's a double whammy. Democrats and, or politician and woman. I, listen, <sighs> I have no idea what what the hell this woman was thinking. Um, if you have something like that in your background, and you decide you're going to run for public office, you are out of your cotton pick in mind. If you think people aren't going to dig that dirt up, get the hell out of here. Yeah. I mean, hell, they fucking, how long did they drag Trump for, you know, grab him by the pussy? Years. And you know, to be honest, that's just locker room talk. Who, who cares? You know, yeah. like I've said before on this show many times, I don't agree with a lot of uh, Trump's talking points. All right. He could do better. Uh, but other than that, I don't care if there are prostitutes lined up around the block sucking his peg D through a hole in the screen door behind the white house. As long as my gas is cheap, the economy's going well, and you're not weaponizing the government against its own citizens. You do you. Um, I would agree with that. Uh, let's see here. Uh, let's see. Uh, people have the have the right to think whatever they want about Gibson's career. The media and Democrats are increasingly comfortable with censoring the truth. And that's not, and that's the problem, not the sex. Correct. And what publication was that? Uh, this was uh, Breitbart. Okay, Breitbart. <clears throat> yep. And 
All right. Fish. Now, how much sympathy are we going to give this woman? Uh, none. You got to pay the stupidity tax. And I hope your parents are no longer alive because they are probably horrifically ashamed. I know I would be. Mm -hmm. But uh, we'll, uh, we'll finish this one off with a little bit of uh, some good news. But uh, Senator Warren and Rep uh, Spappen Spappenberger, Spappenberger won't say if they'll still support uh, Susanna Gibson after online sex scandal. And it's not they a should it. No. 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 Well, listen, if she's this stupid and making these kind of bad decisions and she's and she's just a physician assistant or whatever the hell she was doing, what do you think is going to happen when you give her real fucking power? You give her like that kind of power and she's got poor decision making uh, ability, it's a recipe for a slow motion train wreck. God damn. Yeah. Uh, and these are both uh, Democrats, believe it or not. Senator Mark Warner and Rep. Abigail Spappenberger, uh, both Democrats of Virginia, did not respond to queries on Tuesday whether they are uh, they whether or not they still support Susanna at the uh, Democrat candidate for the Virginia House of Delegates after revelation that she engaged in online schmexual acts for money. So again, uh, amateur adult. Film star. Correct. Uh, the Washington Post on Monday broke that the story of Gibson live stream smack, sh smack shacks. Yep, we covered that. Uh, the report said she encouraged viewers to pay them for a specific request with tips. Mm -hmm. Of course, we get covered that again. Uh, she is a nurse practitioner, a mother of two young children who is running in a highly competitive suburban oh richer district. God, those, two, those poor kids. Those, uh, that's not oh, going to be good for those kids. This is going to, that's not going to go well. No, no. Uh, the Post reported there were more than a dozen videos of the couple captured from the Chatterbait website and archived on another site. Uh, soliciting tips is, is an apparent violation of uh, Chatterbait's terms of service and conditions. In at least two videos viewed by the Post, Gibson tells the video she is raising money for a good cause. Mm -hmm. uh, Gibson posted two photos with Spappenberger, one with uh, and one with Warner to her Instagram account, which she made private on Tuesday after Breitbart News contacted Warner's office about the photo. Nice. <laughs> oh, wow. Trying to run and hide, but you can't hide. run and hide, run and hide. Uh, however, there still is a post from Spappenberger just three days ago where she appears next to Gibson saying, fantastic night supporting Susanna Gibson. I could just imagine those two kids having arguments with other kids in their class and they they look over and they're like well your mother sucks cocks in hell and the other one's like well your mother sucks your dad's dick on the internet and i saw it last night <laughs> yeah you're there's no Good there's money. no coming back yeah there's no coming back from this no. so she might she might as well just you know put her big panty big girl panties on even though she's you know more used to taking them off yeah yeah and uh accept it that's right like like she accepted that load of her husband's spunk, spunk on her face. Fitting thug life. Fitting. Uh, but uh, <laughs> uh, and it ends up here with a uh, Gibson reposted that post, which remains up as of Tuesday. Oh my god, that is just nightmare fuel right there. Yeah, that's wow. Uh, I mean. I, I don't condone, you know, women doing these kind of things. You no, know, I'm not going to participate or partake in it. You know, whatever you do, you. But for crying out loud, if you're running want to run for public office or any kind of politics, and you do this kind of crap, and it comes back, is people are going to find it. People like, will, yeah, if I decided will, to run for a public office. They would use my videos, take all kinds of shit out of context, mm -hmm. and crucify me on the to the totem pole of stupidity. Yeah. Like, come on. Watch Grunt Speak Live every Tuesday and Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern. And if you want to join Pop for Support of Sundays, go to redonkulous.com slash donate and make a monthly pledge. A link is in the meat case box.